Oseo, welcome back to Prep Steading with Nana Binda. Today we're going to be talking about our brand new incubator. We had a, another incubator, an old one, and uh, we took the egg turner out of it and we put it in our new one. And the reason we got a new one is because the other one didn't have the thermostat in the humidity thing and so we got this one so we could regulate it and keep an eye on it and do what we got to do and being this is our very first time we've never done it before we wanted to be able to keep an eye on the humidity and the temperature which is the temperature is supposed to be 99.5 and what's the humidity baby I really can't remember. I have to look it up again. I have to, I'll have to read the directions. But anyways, right now, they say that you're supposed to turn this on and let it warm up, I believe, for eight hours before we put the eggs in it. And we do have our eggs. We still have to check them with the uh, little egg, can, egg candler. It's a, a little electric thing, and it's a light, actually. And you hold it up, <clears throat> excuse me, you hold it up to the egg to make sure there's no cracks or chips. And you're supposed to be able to see the embryo or yolk. After a short period of time. Yeah, after a short period of time. And it takes 21 days before the babies pop out of their little shells. And then uh, after that, we'll put them in a br brooder, which I don't have set up yet. We do have it. We just don't have it set up yet. But uh, hopefully all goes well. And we'll have us a bunch of baby chicks. And then we'll have a bunch of chirping in the house. <laughs> and I get to clean the brooder uh, at least twice a day but that's okay not a problem anyway I reckon that'll be it for now before you leave be sure to like subscribe and click the bell